So yeah guys, this is a frog I definitely recommend from Timu. Highly check it out. This is one I've had so much success with over the past year. I've been fishing a lot. It is a great frog. Got a different couple colors here. This is the last one I tried using out here. Kind of like a purple violet here with a pearl belly to it there. We just went with a solid bone. This one is really, really great. I've been fishing this one a lot um, early on this year and last year. It's a great little popping frog. Had a lot of success with it. Very soft, very, very soft. And then we went with, you know, just a natural green, but again, it still has that pearl belly to it. So yeah, definitely check it out guys. It is a great frog. It reminds me of the Gavacho frog. Great little popping frog. Highly check them out from Timu. Super, super cheap. I think they're like two bucks and um, you can't beat them guys. So again, guys, remember to use my code right here. You guys can get an additional 30% off your order for new users. So yeah, definitely check that out guys. Everything linked in the description below. Got him baby. On that Timu frog. Oh yes. One of my favorite frogs from Timu. I haven't fished this color yet. Fat little fish, look how fat he is. Oh my god. Highly recommend out this little popping frog, guys. One of my favorite frogs to get from Timu. There we go, right there. Solid. See you later, buddy. My favorite frog. And I actually fish it all the time. It has become a staple in my frog box. Very good frog. Again, I'll have it linked in the description down below. You guys can pick up this exact frog that I'm using. Ooh. Ooh. He got off. That was crazy. Right on my feet. That's a hard hook set, guys. Very hard hook set. But we had him. All right, guys. I think that is going to do it for today's video. The bite has really died down like almost 99%. Just caught one other bass after like an hour and a half, maybe close to two hours. Literally nothing else has happened. So I'm going to call it there. It was a fun day. We caught a handful of bass and I uh, really can't complain. They're a beautiful day out here today. That probably didn't help the fishing any because it is such a nice day. Not too many clouds, no wind whatsoever. Um, my topwater bite wasn't really on. I think I caught maybe two on the frog, but really not much going on there. Appreciate you guys watching. This is Matt here with Mad Matt Fishing. And we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.